All right, hello and welcome back. So I just decided I'm just going to stick everything on the lowest of low graphic settings and see if that's good enough to finish it. Be victorious. Wait. Okay, no, nope, it's moving on. I thought it had broken for some reason. I just had to walk up the stairs. But yeah, I put everything on the as low as low can be. Hopefully that's good enough. And it doesn't crash again. Which, I mean, we'll find out soon enough if it does. But let's just get this game finished. You know. We'll just get it finished. And be done with it. Okay, I think I need... Both of the taunts, actually. This one, and I'll stick that one there. What's this? Devour? Well, I can just stick that there. Oh, the big boy's in. I mean, you can really tell it's the lowest of low graphic settings now. But hopefully, we don't have any more crashing. That's what one would hope. Used? Hit it. I think it hit. <sighs> I did do cash verification, like verifying cash integrity thing. As far as I could tell, there was no problem. So. Ah. Uh. Uh. Yeah, just keep bringing in the elites. Oh, we're going in with the big stab. Alright, the big boy is down. Armored Ogre, new codex. Uh... You say he's taking the field, but I don't see him. He's coming this way. The Herald, there he is. Shoot him! Nice! Dab him real good. I missed! Whoops! I'll smack him with my shield. Let's just surround him and mess him up real good, guys. It don't crash. We've we've won. For now, the price was dear, but the vigil holds. Verrill Verrill would be proud. Uh, I couldn't abandon my friends today. Spell is one, but the mother is still Captain. out there. Commander. I've news. We know where the Darkspawn came from. Their retreat left a trail even the greenest of recruits could follow. Oh, nice. Given time, they'll build another army. We must attack. With what, men? The army has taken heavy losses. Dead. Wounded. It will be some time before they can mobilize again. The commander has the right of it. Every day you wait is another day of broodmother spawning new evil. Uh, if the army can't do it, the wardens will have to. We've seen you in action, commander. You and your companions are an army all on your own. Damn right. Let's get out there and twat them. Real good like. Provided I know where I'm going. Well, I can loot these guys at least. Uh, nice helmet, helm of dragon's peak, strength, defense, stamina, regen, barbed fists. You are a frightening force. Blessing of the divine, spell stamina. Yeah. On the battlefield. Save. Only let loose that time. And off we go. Straight to it. Why are we following the road? Oh well, uh, Amaranthine's just a skull and crossbones now. We've been intercepted. Ha! 
Let's wipe them out quickly. Buy some bandits. Okay. A big strike on that guy. Oh, no, wait. Oh, that's right. I did the wrong thing. That's what I wanted to do. Nice damage. Finish him off. Oh, he goes for a whirlwind, but he gets cut down instead. Not really any reason to loot stuff. I mean, these bandits just intercepting me, stopping me from getting there. Could I just leave? And waste this XP? No. Ah, oh, I've been stunned. I thought we're gonna waste the XP, we're gonna cut them down. One more swing, there we go. Alright, that's all of them. Let's move on. Continue on the way. Dragon bone wastes. Alrighty then. Oh, nice. More infighting, it would seem. Get rid of one of these pricks. Can someone please get it off me? You children. Such a pain. I don't need that. I never needed to pick it up. Let's just go, go, go. Let's get this done. Oh, God, there's more of them. And I'm already back on my ass. <sighs> but it, I'm down for too long, and there doesn't seem to be any way of stopping it. And I'm down again. God fucking damn it. Like, it's such an annoying thing. Who thought that was a good idea for an enemy ability? Knock you on your ass so you can't do anything. You might as well take a nap while you wait for it to finish. That's how it feels. Oh, that's another one. Can I just run through them? I don't even have to kill them. Good, we're just gonna run through. Let them fight amongst themselves. We've got a mother to kill. Just go, go, go as fast as we can. Oh shit, a dragon! I think I have to kill the dragon. You know what? Let's try not. Nope, can't do it while in combat. We gotta do it. Oh, come on, get off me. Thank you for the dragon. He's kinda backing me up with this shit. Get off me. Okay, everyone on the fucking dragon. Damn it, did you interrupt my attack? He interrupted again! Nice damage. What? What is... What? Who the hell's attacking you from such a long distance? Oh, goddamn! I look away for one moment. I guess this is what I get for just running through, therefore causing everything and everyone to come at us. It's health, it's pretty low. Take another potion. Oh, we're in.
pool. And we get literally just a stamina potion from it. whoop de fucking do Oh, come on. I don't have to go back and fight them, do I? I think I do. She's got no stamina regen. Don't really want to go back and fight them. I'll get Ogryn back up when possible. An ally that only restores health when the ally falls close to death. Oops. What's the cooldown on this two minute cooldown? God damn. God damn. Wait, does she have something active that drains? Oh shit, she does too. Yeah, hearing this thing? Draining mana instead. Oh. Any hostile spell target cast of general chance of being absorbed into the fade, draining mana instead. Once all mana has been depleted, the shield collapses. That ability should not be turned on. Being attacked by magic. No, don't have that. Jeez, no wonder you've never got mana. Fucking hell. Jeez, no wonder we've never got fucking mana. Or your mana's being drained by a fucking spell shield you don't need. That's good damage. Rather she does that stuff on other abilities. Should've just fought my way fucking through instead. At least then it wouldn't have been screwed like this. Yeah, using that ability definitely screws her. Kills all the mana regen. I mean, she ain't got much regen to begin with, but... Hell, at least I'll be the only mage in Dragon Age 2. That's... That'll be good, at least. So I'm the only one who has to worry about mana. Yeah, you can't do much to me, asshole. And then there's you, who's barely doing anything at all. And he's dead almost instantly. Yes. Amethyst. Alright, everyone get your asses up. We're leaving. Let's get on to the next jar part of this shit. Quickly, please. There we go, out of combat. Save. Oh, actually, hold on. Some people need some... Injury kit consuming. Right here. Alright, now quick save. Off we go. That's what I get for running on through. Bright and proper screwed. An idiot. I'm glad to see that you are well, sister. Oh, Sereni. Oh, thank Mythal you're still alive. What has the architect done to you? Why are you with him? The architect is kind to me. And tender. And he has told me his plan. The Darkspawn are just like us. The architect has freed them. And they search for a place in this world. Just like the Dalish are searching. Everything he's done, he's done to help his people. You can respect that, can't you, sister? Mm. 
Well, I mean, it makes sense to me. Uh, they're monsters, they're not a people. Buy this, Toxin. Oh, it's great, Toxin sends it away. They killed our friends and so many others. Don't you remember? I do. And this is why I must help them. They are like children come into the world with no understanding of what is good and fair. They have a bestial nature, but I've seen them overcome it. They just need to be shown how. Oh, pick your side. You can die. Come with us so that you can tell others. Sure. No, I have work to do. The architect is waiting for me. And for you. He will explain everything. You will see as I have seen. No! Don't go! And she's gone. I honestly have no memory of if the architect comes back at all. Like, I do not remember. He might come back in the second game. Maybe part of the DLC of the second game. But honestly, I just don't know. I, don't, I can't remember. Maybe I should look it up. Maybe I will when I'm done here. Hey, all my stuff's turned off. Right, turn it all back on. Probably when I died. Makes sense to me. That would be when it happened. Doesn't someone have potion craft? Uh, anyone have the ability to do potions? She does, kind of, with expert herbalism. Can she make lyrium potions? Expert lyrium with the distilling agent is more. Distilling agents are required, lesser. Not a lot. Go over there for the Heretic Disciple. Yeah, big damage. Let's just do a detonation, although they're mostly dead now, so it doesn't matter. Take the Sapphire. Don't really need anything else. Flesh Pod. How strange. I'm just gonna try to be pushing the main story. Off, not so much exploring. Because I want to get her done. And I think this will be the last episode of me getting it done. So Armored Ogre went down a lot quicker, at least. Let's go, go, go. More flesh pods. Is there anything in the flesh pod? There's a crystal? Sure, I'll take a crystal. Ah, fuck. I don't remember, can the the groves jump me? I do not remember if the groves can jump you. Felt like a waste. I'd work with him if I could right now, so I don't have to fight so many. I mean, I'd reduce the difficulty, but that just feels cheap. I mean, at least with Rogue Trader, it's fair when I reduce the difficulty, because... Let's see, one time I died in a single turn. Like, the very first turn, I died. So I said, fuck that. And because I had to go through multiple fights to get back to where I was, because the autosave sucked and screwed me. Second time I died, the game bugged. So I said, fuck that, I'm not doing that fight again with the game and being so bugged. We again. No, Uther. That is not how this must begin. I owe you an apology, Commander. When last we met, I intended to explain myself. Fate, however, intervened. Uh oh. Uh, you're experimenting me. Uh, so explain yourself I now. I restrained you only to prevent the misunderstanding that occurred with the rest of your order. Yeah, the sort of misunderstanding that ends with a field of dead bodies. Uh huh. I get those sometimes. I sent the Withered to ask for the Grey Warden's help. 
I should have anticipated that you might view our approach as an attack. I am rarely able to judge how your kind will react. It was most unfortunate. That is fair. Uh, you take the man and blow them dry. Uh, you want another help? My what for? kind has ever been driven to seek out the old gods. This is our nature. When we find one, a blight has begun. Each time we attack your surface lands and you fight back until we are defeated. To break the cycle, my brethren must be freed of their compulsion. For that, I need Grey Warden blood. Uh, uh, yeah, why do you need blood? In order to become what you are, you drink the blood of my kind. To transform, similarly, we must transform. I have created a version of your joining that uses the blood of Grey Wardens. You take the taint into yourself. What we take is your resistance. That is how my brethren are freed. In your blood lies the key to their immunity against the call of the old gods. The Wardens are supposed to stop the Blight. We'll be retired and talking about the glory days in no time. How do they change afterwards? Fair question. Once they are freed, the Darkspawn think for themselves. They speak. They act. Some however, have reacted poorly. They are flawed and they rage against me. The mother gathers them to stop me as she seeks to stop you. I cannot defeat the mother alone and I cannot free the darkspawn unless she is defeated. Our goals are the same. Indeed. Darkspawn or no, he has a good point. Do we really want to keep killing each other forever? This is what my sister saw. An ally amongst the Darkspawn. This is an opportunity we cannot pass up. Help me kill the mother. And after it is done, I will leave to continue my work. Uh, what is this mother exactly? The most flawed creation. Freedom drove her mad. And she has poisoned the minds of the others. She has influence with the ones who have not been freed. And she gathers them as an army. I do not seek to rule, my brethren. I only seek to release them from their chains. Uh, how did you become free? I was born as I am. An outsider amongst my kind. Why? I do not know. Why do some of your kind become Grey Wardens? Why do some possess magic? I have no answers. Well, I mean, at least... Makes sense to me. Uh, perhaps the other one, I don't want to be free. Very well, you have an ally. Yeah, pretty much. Ally away. Playing with their newfound minds keeps the dark spawn away from Orzammar. I'm happy. Agreed. This is the right thing to do. Sarani believes well, at least everyone's in agreement here. That's nice. Thank you, Commander. I realize what a leap of faith this is for you. I hope that I prove worthy of your trust. The mother lies ahead, Warden. I cannot approach her physically. Her children protect her from my power. But when you reach her, I will do whatever I can to help you. You have my promise. Fair enough. Uh, save again. And off we go. What the? Architect's Pyre, Tower of Trauma, Tower of Flame, Tower of Healing. What is all of that? Oh man, if I have to unlock stuff as I go. Vinter, Vinter Towers. Wait, am I supposed to do something in those towers? Things, I'm going to try and insta-kill this one. Get the fuck off me, asshole. Try a detonation. 
Uh, yeah, now an ally can summon a powerful inferno to uh, target area friendly fire possible. And I'm off. Yes. Let's go back. See if there's something I can interact with in each of these towers. Yeah, I mean it says Tower of Trauma, Tower of Healing, Tower of something. Sockets. Hmm. Wait, what am I putting in these? It's like it's missing something. What was I putting in them? Uh, find crystals to fit other sockets. Ah, oh, shit. Which means they're in the flesh pods, aren't they? Crap, I better go back and look at all the damn flesh pods. So, that gives me Tower of Trauma. Artifact is stunning all creatures in the area. Crap, alright, let's go back, loot all the flesh pods. Gotta loot everybody looking for crystal. One, I need three more. Three more crystals are required. Ogre oh flesh pods. He had a crystal, right? Two more are required. One more is required. Excuse me. Yes. One, two, three. There we go. Socket. That gives me Tower of Flame. Oh, of course, the healing one is the last one. Alright, I'll go back up in case, because i got to loot everything. I'd hate to miss one crystal among the corpses. And the flesh. Fleshy goo I may not have seen earlier. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Alright, well, looks like I've gotten them all except whatever's in here. Nathaniel, you're up. Open the box. With a crystal inside. Excellent. So it was worth coming back, which means I only gotta find three more crystals to get the Tower of the Healing Juju. Hmm. And of course, now we gotta run all the way back. I'm gonna keep this damn button held so I can find all the juicy thingamajigs along the way. I really wish you guys wouldn't go pop pop as we run. Save it as I go back down. At least I got all the towers. I don't know if it means I can only do them once. A single target with fire. It looks like it's one I've already activated and then we got all of these with more fleshy pods and more corpses. It's three are required. We are required. Flesh pod. Magic mana regen out of combat. Is that good for her? Because she needs more magic regen out of combat. Oh, well, the one she has is actually better at magic regen out of combat. Oh, in combat. Whatever. Uh oh. Enemies. Uh, hit the thing before he hits me. The less these assholes jump on me, the better. Do this. Maybe it'll stop it. Let's deal with you real quick, then we can deal with the big boy. Three crystals are required. One, two, three, and four. Ooh, nice. Ahmed has no crystal. Two crystals are required. Two crystals are required. I see one flesh pod and a chest. I'll just throw an aura of pain. Because if these assholes jump me, at least I'll have aura going. What determines the damage of this? Because it doesn't tell me. I wish it'd tell me. Two crystals. Two crystals are required. Still two. Still two. 
Got this. I don't want these assholes jumping me. It's incredibly annoying. Alright, I'm taking care of him. I'll grab this loot before I go downstairs. None of what I desire. Maybe one of them has it. Shield bash. Explosion! Uh oh, there's more runners. Yay. Someone leveled. Caster leveled. Alright, come on. One of you has to have a crystal in your guts. No? Really? Come on. Right, only one crystal left. Unless I've miscounted somehow. Yep, I haven't miscounted, so there is one left. I hope it's in this chest. Nathaniel, do your duty. Please tell me there's a crystal in there. Yeah, there's a crystal in there. That was a Davinta shield. Any useful? No. Uh, let's put that shit-looking hat on. Take the shit-looking hat off. I really don't like having hats when they make force you to look a certain way into the nest and hopefully the end of the game there she is into place the gray warden comes the instrument of the father oh and the father he is but a shadow oh how my children protect me how they love me i have told you many times mother i am not the father i am simply the architect it does not change what you are you too Beautiful music left us with nothing. It was a mistake to free you. It has left you with madness. I am truly sorry. Ah, uh, the other tends to free the darkspawn. I trust him. Ah, but perhaps the warden would like to hear how it was that the father began the blight. You want the source of the Archdemon? The one who brought all our kind to the surface? Here he is! Oh? Uh, how so? Well, paint me green and call me a turnip. Ah, uh, there it is then. Unfortunate. I did find the old god, Athemio. But I did not wish another blight. I attempted my joining ritual. My hope was that this would free all Darkspawn. Unravel the curse from its source. Alas, I was unlucky. Uh, uh do you even think about the repercussions of your actions? Well, How I've heard do you all. feel about what I have done. The mother is mad. She cannot be allowed to be gone, Shadow. You cannot harm the mother any more than you already have. And now the hero is alone. No, I'm not. I got three people with me. The mother knows your ways. You will not let her be. No, not after what she's done. So it must end. It all must come crashing down. Perhaps we will hear the song again when we die. Oh, let it come. Let it come. Oh, shit. Wasn't expecting her mouth to do that. Well, let's smash the tentacles first. I was not expecting her mouth to go like that. That was quite a surprise. I have no idea how this how, how this battle works. Right, you two go stand over there. And she's down already. What the fuck? That's not good. 
Oh, heals her as well. Go over there. You go over there. Out of melee. Leave the tentacles to me. Become an indomitable shield for a while. Once I kill the tentacle, the tentacle stays down. Wait. No, I'm still doing damage. Finish the tentacle. Uh -oh. More things are coming. Only one of the tentacles left. Okay, this is time for a burst. There's quite a few enemies here. Shit! I mean, that works. Uh, he's capable of stunning all creatures in the area. Wait, a friendly fire possible. Yeah, let's stun everything for a moment. I think everyone should just focus her for the moment. Fine. Dude, what are you doing in the area? Get out of here. Well, oh no, she just picked me up. Oh no, I'm dead. That's doing a fuck ton of damage. That did a ton of damage. Oh, not again! That's not fair, you've got like super damaging... ...pickups. That's not cool! But I gotta make sure I save that heal for like... ...end of the battle and I gotta make sure my two ranges are far back. You know only if you stay there. I'm going in alone. It was a mistake to free you. It has left you. Since the free. Enough. You and you go all go back there. We hit this. Do that. Yeah, summon the wolf. Come on, what are you doing? Hit the damn tentacle! Ow! Move over there a bit. So you don't get hit by... AoE damage. What are you... What are you doing? Get over here! Whatever. No, it don't matter. Just do scrapper. It's fine. All right, one down. Hit the next. Yeah, detonate. Let's hit the children. I don't know if the children will constantly spawn or not. Oh shit, the little ones can do that! I'll go and go assist them. I'll go and go assist them, damn it! What are you doing? Are you stuck? Oh no, I think he's gone insane or something. No, he's doing something. Did he glitch? Ogren, what are you doing? 
How about I just turn everything off? Yep. Oh, he had Ravening Storm going, whatever the fuck that is. I just go back to what I set you to. Alright, final tentacle. Oh shit, there's not the final tentacle. Why aren't you... Attack, bro. I need you to get in here. No, fine. Um... This... Nearest visible attack. Because apparently you won't do that on your own as you're bloody broken. Why won't you do what you're supposed to? I mean, sure, when this happens, it's understandable. Oh, again! Got throw in the Tower of Flame. Kill all of those pricks. Why are you breaking? Get in there! I'll just clear that. Aggressive. How about just default then? Second wind. Oh, I didn't even need to. Wait, where are they? Get up here. Oh, no. Oh, well, of course you can't do anything. Better quick stun. Throw in a potion. I said throw in a potion. Alright, this should. There we go. Oh, right in the mouth. I don't think we ever see a brood mother again. I think this is the only time we ever see one, which is a little disappointing. But considering they don't ever touch lost demons again, it makes sense. You don't want to get all sexy time with the monsters. Stupid sexy enemies. I mean, all she's got is her tits out, but come on. It's not that bad. After the death of the mother, the remaining Darkspawn forces scattered and fled back into the deep roads. The raids on Amaranthine came to an abrupt end. The architect apparently kept his word, gathering his remaining disciples to follow the rest of their kind back underground. Those great ones in other nations were appalled to hear of the architect's continued resistance, but were unable to attract him down despite years of effort. Some within the Order have claimed that the Architect's survival guarantees another blight, yet the Deep Roads have lately been quieter than any can recall. Most have resign, uh, resignedly, decide, resignedly decided that it is now in the Maker's hands. The destruction of Amaranthine did not endear the Grey Wardens of the people of Ereldon, although much of the citizenry wanted to forget the terrible event and get on with their life, a small segment pledged to exact revenge against the Wardens. People whispered that the commander of the Abordans was trying to influence Pharrell in politics once again, and suggested the burning of Amaranthine was part of a larger plot. The rumours grew until, in, inside a year, a mob appeared at the gates of Vigil's Keep. Although most of the rioters were shown mercy and survived the bloody clash, public opinion of Great Wardens turned south for years until the Wardens led an effort to rebuild Amaranthine. Although the war devastated many farms in the Isling, all agreed that the loss would have been greater without soldiers for, for protection. The farm holders developed a certain reverence for the Warden Commander as well as ongoing reliance on the Grey Wardens for order and protection. 
The annals of the Great Warden's Herald Command as regards its defense and vigils keep as a crucial victory. The Order's more clever recruits often spent days studying the account in an attempt to understand the Commander's tactics. Peace allowed the Wardens to replenish their numbers. Soon, Vigils Keep bore a capable army with Wardens at its core. From their ranks emerged new heroes to challenge threats to Amaranthine and all of Ferelden. Through taxes and levies, the Keep was rebuilt. Years later, Voldrak Glavanok stood on the battlements and pronounced that the defenses were acceptable. He would never speak more highly of any human engineering. Most nobles claim the Grey Warden were... Great ones were involved in Ben as Morel's disappearance on the eve of the final battle against the Darkspawn. Dark whispers hint that a conspiracy to ask the wardens from Amrathine is still afoot. Uh, among the many legends that the Vigil spawned was one of the great heroes of the next age, a sheep herder turned soldier by the name of Sir Alec the Valiant, who continually founded, eventually founded an order of knights that lasted a thousand years. Oh, that's nice. The Vigil soldiers wearing the distinctive silverite armor that Master Wade crafted came to be known as the Silver Order under the tutelage of the Wardens. The Silver Order developed into one of Ferelden's most revered military forces, a lasting memory of the Vigil's famous commander. Uh, with Velana and the Arctic gone from the region, the Pilgrim's Path began to see traffic again. The massacre of the militia and merchants, however, led to hostil hostilities between neighboring human settlements and any Dalish clans that passed by. One human villager soon kidnapped and murdered a Dalish child. The clans reacted by giving the Wending Woods a wide berth, but both sides that but both sides know that at some point the elves will return for vengeance. A few years after Cal Harol was emptied by Darkspawn, Ozamar began sending expeditions to rediscover the knowledge of smithing that had been lost. Eventually, House Helmini decided that uh, Cal Harol was too important to be abandoned. A Tremendous cost of Dwarven lives, they cleared the tunnels leading to it of all Darkspawn, making the road between Ozamar and the fortress safe again. Cal Harol was reclaimed for Ozamar once and for all. Oh, how nice! In time, the Arling began to forget the tales of apparitions in the Black Marsh. Uh, slowly, settlers began to return. The veil was thin, and thus the area was still dangerous, but people don't care. The village slowly rebuilt. Wealthy merchants uh, left in touch, ended remain Grey Warden. Now the answer was no longer a warden. Uh, the Templars declared him an apostate, so he left the Wardens. Uh, never saw her clan again, but neither did she forsake her culture. After several years, she disappeared one day. Uh, surmised that she went to look for her sister. And uh, he realized life was not for him. He said goodbye to his sister. His new nephew left to seek his fortune. In time, that nephew became a great warden himself in emulation, and then rose to, oh, my command, warden commander. How nice. He did some things... But their mother dead seemed to lose her purpose and withdrew from her friends in the order and spoke to less and less. Uh, I'm just going to skip through this. People want to pause and read them. They can. I'm not going to read them. Uh, the blight well and truly over. It was time for him to move on. Uh, some claimed the commander headed west to Orle, chasing after some dark-haired sorcerers who had fought alongside him. Whether he found her or not is unknown. And then credits... Which we shall skip it out again. All right, I hope you all enjoyed. That's Dragon Age truly complete. Dragon Age Origins. At some point in the future, I'll do Dragon Age 2. And then Inquisition. And then the new game that came out. If it's any good. Apparently it comes out very soon. Although it might be out by this video's time. Regardless, I'll probably begin recording Kane's Wrath Monday. Whether that'll be start going up before this episode or not, I don't know. But either way, hope people enjoyed. Later.